ultimate transition. So let's see. I don't know. This uh, this could be like a swan song for MVD or something extremely ironic. Let's see what happens here. <laughs> You're both definitely correct. Let's see what we get here. Fresh out the gate. J-Tail's the first one to draw blood, man. Leave it to MVD, man. He's setting up his traps early on. Not even wanting to deal with the maneuverability that Diddy Kong brings in this matchup. Yeah. Oh, honestly, dude, I have not seen a lot of Diddy Kong. Uh, seems like they have all... They all just kind of stopped playing Diddy Kong. There's, I know, obviously, there's a couple left up. J-Tails will be one of, the, one of them here in the top 16 on the winner's side. So the character's got to be got to be still good. <laughs> I don't know where they went, man. Uh-oh. Okay. Grenades. He's cooking them just a little bit too long. I love how MVD cooks his grenades before he decides to throw them. He wants to get the explosion at the right time because if you throw them too early, obviously the opponent can throw them back. Mm, using that high recovery. It's like, you like I'm watching Brawl again, man. Serious. Yeah, literally. This is definitely a Brawl matchup for the ages. So go ahead and touch that banana pill if you want. There's a C4 under it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Back row. Okay, goes for the up throw here this time. Nice Air dodges time. away and then fakes him out with the up smash. You know, the good thing is, uh, MVD, of course, still very comfortable using those bananas, too. So anytime J-Tails misplaces one, he's going to have two grenades, you know, C4 and a banana to work with. So. Okay, now in Brawl, he would have been dead right there because that up tilt was ridiculous. Oh, nice. Was able to grenade his way out of that. And that was some good stuff. Yeah, damn, he was super high up there. He took a long time to come back down. He did. He's kissing the blast zone. Okay. I think he's trying to put a C4 on him there. Okay, taking a banana pill once more away from him. Tries to grab it back and meets the tail end of a boot. Yeah, it looks like the Diddy Kong obviously having a much harder time ending stocks here uh, than Snake does. I think MVD living to almost like 160, wasn't that the first time? Yeah, something like that. Rolls right out of the way. I like these dash attack attempts here from MVD, but he's just a little bit off the mark, and I, it really seems like JTL is just doing a good job at punishing those overextensions. He's just missing Dacus, dude. He just wants to, he wants to do his up smash sliding. Yeah, yeah, you're right. The only thing Snake is missing, dude, which I'm very glad for. You like his new down smash, or you like the old one better? Dude, oh, yeah, 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 down smash is different, dude. Dude, honestly, uh, I think it would be really obnoxious to play him with his old down smash. He already has, it's really hard to deal with projectiles. The amount of stuff he has. Proximity mines and C4s and C3 butterflies all over the place. What are we going to do? I do think the animation of his new down smash is hilarious, though. He just <laughs> <laughs> when did he ever do that in Metal Gear Solid? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Sakurai, you got it, man. Okay, down tilt forward air. Some trademark Diddy Kong stuff here, but he's keeping this thing pretty close here. Oh, I, I might have spoke too soon. My yeah, bad. But again, it's just so easy for MD to find to find these spots to, KO, to, to you know take stocks off. But uh, J Tails really has to struggle to find an opening and and have Snake at the percent for a stock to you know end. Those up smashes are not going to do it. You know, the hoo ha is not working anymore. It's just like how do you end these stocks? Yeah, Snake is a big boy himself too. A lot of people forget about that. Definitely on the heavier end of the spectrum. Yeah, he's banana pill. Messed up, dude. He gave MD a banana. Nikita's okay. way faster for no reason. Right. <laughs> I usually see like a lot of Nikita baits where like they'll start it up, then hit shield and drop it right in front of the opponent, you know? Uh, but since it's just so fast, we don't quite see as much as we've seen in years prior. Okay. Up smash, nice. Soft toss on the grenade there. Set up the wall. j -tail's moving and grooving though around this wall. Yeah, this is oh. real. Uh, people complain about Richter and Simon throwing out projectiles, dude. I think this is the actual, this is the actual problem here. Yeah, man, the monsters walk Earth, dog. It's Snake. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> you know right, damn MVD. well he was waiting for that. It waiting to do on stream. It's gonna be the first the first combo in this combo video. <sighs> that's all rough. Right. That's all rough. Right. Alrighty, MBD, you got it. This man. matchup does not look fun at all for Diddy Kong. I don't know how he's supposed to end stocks earlier than like 170, dude. 170. Now J has been around for a while though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been around for a while, so you should know how to well obviously it could be a a bit of a, a refresh though too, you know, but I, I just I'm think it's sure it's, he knows how to deal with a bit of snake. Yeah, it's just like first you gotta get snake to like first you gotta get snake to at least 160, like to even start thinking about getting KO. Then you gotta find an opening between all the grenades, Nikita, C4, like and this damn foot that he's throwing around is down oh. smash too. Snake is a body contortionist, man. Like <laughs> who can actually bend like that? I don't think he's the only character that can bend like that in this game. ZSS. Oh, and you know what? Sonic's up there. He's he's doing something crazy with his legs too, man. They're all hitting the same yoga studio. <laughs> Thanks, Weefit. Oh, what? Lord Keepers, it really? Who picked that? Was that J-Tails? 
I'll definitely Jay tells. No, I know the music counter pick is like the ultimate one, but that song is not Chris. Th this is, a, I think this is a good song. I think there's better songs than Pokemon Sages, though. Some people swear by Lord Keepers, anyway. It's fine. It's cool. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I, I think one of my favorite parts about this game is the fact you can choose any song from the series on any stage. From the oh series. yeah, that is. That is pretty awesome. You know, I, I would like for there to be more songs on some of the stages. Probably more of the third party ones. Like I'd, I'd like a regular version of Snake Eater with, you know, Cynthia singing. You want to sign those contracts? I know, right? You, I know. You, you know how many contracts they had to sign to get this character in this game in the first place? <laughs> right, they had to change his logo up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm just happy. You know, beggars can't be choosers. I'm just happy he's back, man. Yep. I'm happy to see J Tails obviously rocking and rolling here, man, in top 16 as well. He's just doing his damn thing. See if he can figure something out here. Uh, the one stock he was able to take in the first game wasn't until over 106%. So he's going to have to pull up the stocks a lot earlier yep. or win neutral a lot more. Okay, there's an up smash. This stuff trying to keep going on that top platform. Builds up the wall, and he knows that JTS is coming back for that banana pill. Okay, forward tilt. Some good stuff there. He's reading a lot of these over senses here from JTels because he knows he's just trying his hardest to get in that he might not be picking the best option to do it. Oh, wow. Okay. No way. I don't know where it's coming from. Okay. It's so fast. You don't need, it's so hard to read while you're, while you're giving your own character, too. It's too many options. Up till two in a row, three in a row. The first you don't succeed, try, try again, I guess. It's so reliable, you know. Obviously not as uh, not as ridiculous as it was in Brawl, but still extremely reliable. Hitbox is great. Mm -hmm. Sometimes safe on shield, depending on how far you are. Safe. Nice. Using the uh, very nice, very nice. Using the armor from the throat to uh, to deal with that grenade and get the, the hoo ha on the platform, top platform. Yes, right. That was some awesome situational awareness there. Got to be aware of everything that Snake brings to the table. A lot of times people get so caught up in like his tilts and his jabs that they forget that man. He's, his projectiles are all over the place, especially where you least expect it. So confident with these dash attacks too. That shot is definitely not safe on shield. Okay. Oh my god, the duck. Oh wait. Oh, actually off the mark. I think he actually forward aired the Nikita. Yeah, he forward aired the, uh, the up smash. Oh, he has he has a C4 on him. Oh, but he set it back on him that time. It's fine. That's where he wants it. <laughs> He's trying to get it on GTS. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, All right, we take those. Are you serious? I get oh my gosh. I don't want to, I don't, everything's playing out his mind right now, dude. Uh-oh. Oh, he didn't have it. He didn't have it. He, he wasn't playing enough, uh, what's the name of that snake game they play again? I forget. Uh, where the what? snakes are just doing, uh, down B over and over, teching, teching the up. Dude, I forget the name of it. I'm sorry. Oh, man. It's, I don't, it's I don't been a while, know. dude. Brawl was 10 years, or uh, 8 years ago. Dude. Yeah. Well, actually, I mean, it was technically 10 years ago. I mean, 2008, 2018, I mean. Yeah. I feel old, dude. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah. Another, another good thing about the stage for uh, Jay Tails, he doesn't really have to worry about up smash on the edge like that because the platforms are right over the edge, so up smash is not going to be able to uh, edge guard him. Okay, Jay Tails doing a little bit better here in this match. Has MVD off of his feet. That's exactly not where Snake wants to be. One, oh, tries to go for jab right to grab. That was some good stuff. I think he's waiting for the up smash to come down too. Also, he's, dude, MVD is. Again, so comfortable with this character. It's been so long since he played it. It seems like it seems like he never stopped. In fact, I don't think he ever stopped. What was that? I have no idea what hit him, dude. I'll be real. What was with you. that? I think I don't I have no idea, dude. I think he might have traded with up tilt or something. There's nothing else that would kill him. Like that the fast. beginning animation or something? Yeah, it must have canceled out the beginning animation up tilt, because nothing else would kill him that fast off the top, but Yeah. Wow. Alrighty. Just like damn, I should've should have switched off the video snake too. Well, I mean, we got to see J-Tails come alive a little bit more in that game. We, we got to see a, a hoo-ha. Um, and then, of course, he seemed to be a little bit more aware of the projectiles. I mean, you, you kind of touched on it. Um, he used the grab armor to kind of, you know, eat the grenade, explode, and he was able to go for that grab follow-up. Uh, I'd like to see him kind of keep that mindset as we move over into this next one here. Uh, there's quite a bit on the line here for J-Tails. Everybody's never playing Diddy Kong again. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I, I, thought, I honestly see. thought he was going to play both. Uh, but I don't think there's any reason to. I don't think we're going to see the Diddy Kong Cloud or Duck Hunt ever again from him. I think it's done. Not complaining. MVD Duck Hunt. Good, good, good times. The, the most valuable Duck Hunt, man. That's what the D stood for. Can I get a Cynthia theme? Come on, please. Hello? Okay. And then so 
Disciple just let me know that it was the beginning animation of the up tilt in the yeah. trade. Okay, I didn't know what he was doing. Like, it just kind of caught him in the first few frames. And I mean, it was sick, but I that was cool. Did he monkey flip kick into him? I think so. So, in this game, as far as I know, if you can, you can trade attacks with grabs, and the animation will cancel for the attack. The, the attack will win. The attack will win. It will, can it will cancel the animation, though. Which is really, really strange. Oh, okay. J Tails a Toon Link. Okay. Interesting. This is not what I expected because uh, it seems like for me, all the Toon Link players are just straight to the Young Link. Yeah. That character's OD. Free, free, free. I'm not going to say anything about Toon Link. I don't know how good he is in this game, but as far as I know, like uh, the amount of Young Link players that I see uh, is really telling. Yeah, it's that actually ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm still a Link loyalist. I haven't switched up yet, man. I don't I don't expect to anytime soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the Link players, you know, for the most part, still playing Link. But the, all, all the Toon Link players, I feel like just straight to Young Link. That's yeah. it. I don't blame him either, man. Young Link is just he's out of control. But, you know, Toon Link definitely certainly has his place in the meta. I know he certainly came in uh, came into having his time to shine his, at the end of Smash 4. Um, and we're kind of seeing a blast from the past here. I mean... MVD kind of getting a bit of a taste of his own medicine. Yeah, dude, MVD have, having a hard time to deal with these bombs. And everything, but I would say that. Watching him play Snake. Uh, but it's really going to come down to how he's going to find these KOs here. I think up air is still uh, relatively useful. MVD always recovering high. Mighty Oh, wow. Up B on stage. Up B's a landing option. I would take those. Oh, that was okay. I think he wanted to snap right away, or if not snap, since he was facing the wrong way, uh, kind of air dodge back over to ledge. But this is super interesting, man. I'll be real. This is the first uh, first tune like I've seen. Maybe this is what J Tails was waiting for. Like this is my final, my final card right here, man. It's my pot of greed. Yeah, honestly, I wish he hadn't waited too long because this is looking a lot more clean than his dude Kong was uh, in, in this matchup, at least. MVD really struggling to figure something out here. This, this is completely different than the first two games we watched. Yeah, he is going ham right now. Okay, trying to figure out his landing options. Gets the pivot grab right into the back throw. I don't think MVD can survive another one of those, too. This is so interesting. The bombs are just uh, so much bigger, so much faster than the grenades seem to be. Uh oh, okay. Uh -oh. Finally puts a point on the board for himself. This match is definitely getting away from him. Okay, one more solid conversion here. JTL should be able to close out this next stock here on MVD. We might actually have ourselves a set here. I didn't want to see another 3 0. Okay. Yeah, I wonder, uh, dude, I wonder why, why too late. You know, like, what? Again, I, I, I see obviously what the young players are trying to do, but it seems like too late. All right, never mind. You know, what, what am I saying? JTL is putting in work here. One stock away from uh, taking his first game of the set. Okay, sets up. Sets up the up smash. Okay, so Z drops the grenade. Now, I wonder if he... Now, I know when Snake uh, drops a grenade, if he Z drops or whatever, and the opponent picks it up, I wonder if he can st if he can still make them drop it. In this game? No, I don't no, think they got rid of that. That was, that was really nuts and wrong. Yeah, like, if he just hit shield, like, the opponent would drop it too. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. that's messed up. Okay, j -Tail's certainly oh, cooking. Oh, my goodness. Looking for a bomb right into up air. I wonder if MVD is maybe... Uh, Thinking about this game number four here already. All I right. don't know, man. Oh, maybe not. All right. 127 percent. Snake is a big boy. Oh wait a Whoa. minute! Not big enough. J tells with the Tiger Woods fist bump. Yeah, he definitely found his answer here. This is looking a lot better than that Diddy Kong. Those Diddy Kong matches. Uh, be able to fight back with his own explosives himself. Not having to worry about trying to catch, uh, desperately trying to catch Snake. You know. Snake's going to run away from me. I, I want that. I want that to happen. Yeah, yeah and I know MBD is feeling like home sweet home, but, I mean, if he's going to stay Toon Link, I wouldn't mind seeing the Diddy Kong just one more time, man. Nah, but he said I'm, I'm sticking true to my guns, <laughs> or I guess my grenades. That would be that would be a little ironic. Oh, I used to, someone on Twitter says Kvoth was pronounced Koth. Koth? Were we lied to earlier? Dude, we'll never, we'll never get it right. Game okay. number four. Here. Words are hard, man. Okay. <laughs> MVD coming back to uh, Pokemon Stadium. Oh, I wonder why he rap. Yeah, I'm actually wondering why he came here too. I know we've seen it before uh, when K Voth, I hope that's how it's pronounced in Conga played. It seemed to be more of like a blast zone differential between this stage and the last one, but this one here? Not exactly sure. Nice. Good punish. Right on the shield. Oh. Okay, that, that's a classic brawl setup, man. 
I feel bad about saying that, but it's real. I feel like a lot. Of, you know, I'm sure there's a lot of people who did play brawl. You know, watching these games, but probably the same amount of people who don't who didn't play brawl at all. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, that's true. A lot of these kids this is their first time experiencing Snake at high level. That was a really interesting setup there oh, that he went for. I, oh, I, I, the C4 dang. was there, man. That's so hard. You gotta keep tracking that at all times. His his uses are just like, like the first trap he sent. He went for the down throw. And then he had the C4 on one side, so if he rolled forward, he would have got blown up. Or if he would have rolled backwards, he would have ate a down smash. See, it's those setups like that that really make the difference here in this matchup. Because that, that last game was a, just a slaughter. Yep. I mean, he did, uh, did figure something out near the end. It was, again, too, a little too late. Boomerang's not going to save you. Uh oh. Okay. Projectiles on deck. Tries to go for the Zarin. Oh, don't give him any more explosives, man. Oh! Almost got the forward air. That was wild. He was not... Dude, that could have easily traded and went completely terrible for details. Oh, yeah. Okay. I like this. Both players kind of feeling each other right here in the neutral. Like that we're not seeing quite the explosiveness that we've seen from JTales in that last game. He's just kind of smothered MVD here, though he's putting a little bit more respect on his name. Love that. Catches the grenade on shield. Keeps got the pressure him. up, and there you go. Finally closing out that first stock. 66, not too bad. Okay, has to. Oh, nice. Goes for the. Oh, okay. Went for the footstool there that time. Um, I thought he actually had the C4 right under him, but he actually had it up on the top platform. Okay. So this, is, this is super interesting to watch because I feel like this kind of matchup would be really, really slow and kind of uh, kind of can't be in Smash 4, but it seems like, you know, even though they're for the most part just kind of throwing things at each other, it's going by really, really fast and pretty exciting to watch. Oh, my. Scary, yeah. man. When you hear him say that, it's like, damn, where was the C4? Right. When you hear that now or you hear that there, you just don't even know what to think. Okay, Zare right into dash attack. Liking his conversions here. A bit a closer game, too. Yeah, but again, still so much better than these, those Diddy Kong matches. Okay, there's a Nikita. Don't get too close. Oh, it's hard, man. It moves so fast. Can't, sometimes you just can't dodge it. Oh, wait a second. Answer's back. He's going to get off stage. Oh, uh, yeah. He learned his lesson. You've hit me with one too many up airs, good sir. Here's a back air. Nice long lasting hitbox. Okay, and he's using his projectiles to kind of stop the grenades in their place, too. All right, getting a little impatient there with that run up, up smash, back throw. I don't think he's going to do it. Yeah, I love that. He's walking close to the C4, trying to bait out MVD, pressing that down B again. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, wait. I like this. How do you soft dare there just in case MVD got a little too antsy and decided to come up there and get him? There's a dash attack. This match is starting to get away from what him a little do? bit. Where do you go? Oh, he, he air got dodged. scared of it. He oh, he got scared of it. No. J Tails. MVD will take it 3 1 over J Tails. But man, you know, at the very least, he definitely found his answer to Snake here. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure if we, if we see Snake again in bracket, I wouldn't be surprised if he went straight to, to uh, 